2015. We are on our way. I can't wait. I'm so excited and Dan is just sitting there really bored like. But if you guys watched our vlog last year, this is our second year that we're going and we're gonna try, I hope, to get um, more footage actually in the con. Um, like I was saying last year, it is a really, really small con, so there's really not too much going on, but it is really nice to get away and be around other people who love anime and meet some of the English voice actors and do a little bit of shopping. The dealer's room isn't really that big or anything, so I guess it's kind of good so we don't spend too much money, but it is already <laughs> starting to rain, and actually it just started as we were heading out so there you go but um I'll check in with you guys later we're here yay um I guess we were supposed to go in there I don't know destination is on the right we did this last year too where yeah. we had no clue where we were going we just parked somewhere yeah but this is the hotel that it's hosted at and also where we are staying. Yay, we are here. Yeah. on day one. We have gone to the dealer's room. We also saw a panel with Anthony Bowling, who is a English voice actor for Funimation, if you guys didn't already know. But this again is our hotel room and um, it's kind of similar to the last one. The room's a little bit differently set up. But um, yeah, it's, it's pretty similar. And as you can see, I am in my full Miku cosplay right now. Except for my shoes. I didn't buy any shoes, so I just used some black Converse because I figured, you know, that might be something that Miku would wear. So let's go over and check out what Dan's doing. Let's see what he's doing. I think he was sitting here last time. I was filming, he was just looking through the book. It's not like we don't live in this state and know what's going on. Are you gonna say no, hi? I wanna go to Lee's Chinese restaurant. You wanna go to a Chinese restaurant? You don't wanna go get pho? We don't have pho here. It, they do in Williston. Yeah, that's Williston. You think I wanna drive there right now? That's like 15 minutes away. And in the dealer's room so far, all I got was a plushie of Ayn from Cowboy Bebop. He is so cute. I love my plushies, so of course I had to get him. But other than that, I haven't really picked up anything yet. Um, but after this, we are going to a panel with um, the Simmons sisters. They're also English voice actors. And then I think I'm gonna go and make something out of perler beads. But again, it's just day one. I hope we can get more pictures and video and stuff actually in the con, but I don't know, we'll see. Hey guys, it is day two of Bakaratsu Con, and it is a little bit, I think it's around one o'clock or something. So we've already gone to a couple of panels, again, with all of the English voice actors that they have, um, Anthony Bowling, Genevieve, and Juliet Simmons, and those are always fun. We really like going to those panels, so those are all done. And then we also went to the little cafe that they have. There is a chicken behind me. <laughs> um, <laughs> we went to the cafe that they have, and we had some dangos, and some mochi, and some melon pan, and some origiri, so it was very yummy. Um, they had also some bubble tea, 
and everything. <laughs> He's now attacking me. Um, but I don't know if you guys had seen Dan's cosplay yet, but he is a jacket from Miami. Hotline, Hotline Miami. Hotline Miami. I don't know. And of course, I'm Monica today. If you guys saw, I did a review of this cosplay um, a, like a month or so ago. So you guys have already seen me in it. I if you have you know. seen that, and let me actually just turn on the light, but I will show you guys what it looks like in the mirror here. So this is my full Monica schoolgirl uniform. I have the correct shoes today. So that's what that looks like if you hadn't seen it already. And then of course here is the badge that they have it. These are just their little characters that they have. But um, that's pretty much what's going on today. So we'll check in again later. Oh, and I forgot one more thing because I didn't tell you guys what we did last night. So we did go to a speed running panel where there was just volunteers who ran through classic Mario games. We also did a perler bead panel and if you guys don't know what they are they're just these little plastic beads that you iron and a lot of people like to use them to make 8-bit characters. So I made a Yoshi. So I think that's really cute. So I just wanted to share that with you guys. So the con is, well, it's technically not over, but we are leaving now. It is Sunday and we are all done with the con. We didn't really pick up too much in the dealer's room. In fact, I think I just showed you the only thing that we got already. And I did pick up some things in Artist Alley, which I'll probably just show off in our October haul, which is on the way. I've already paid for it. It's coming from Ami Ami. So I don't know which one's coming out first, but if you want to know exactly what we picked up at the con, you can check that video out. And um, yeah, I don't know, we did, um, just some more panels and things. We didn't really do any of the games. Um, well, we never have. Yeah, we don't normally do those. We just check out the panels and do some shopping and I don't know, just some random things. But um, again, this con is pretty small, so it's really hard oh, to geez, say <laughs> exactly what, um, you know, there's not too, too much. We played some video games and some stuff but I am sad that it's over and our next con hopefully will be back at Anime Boston in March but until then no more con it's sad but uh yeah hope you guys enjoyed seeing a glimpse we did get some shots inside this time and we'll see you guys next time bye